but I've come down to this corner and you can see how the fence runs down the road there's a bit of an angle and runs back along there well originally it was a straight corner not a cut-off corner like this is and at this corner here there was a rock mark marking a rock well there's little bits of rock and there's been a bit of digging and the, you can see the banks being filled here so I didn't find anything there but sort of intersecting the, the two fences and measuring as best I could I did find a rock mark here it's a drill hole and two wings on the line of this boundary now if we just go back to my little trusty plan here you can see there was a rock mark in the corner that's gone RM drill hole and wings in rock on the line 360 degrees 0 2 minutes 30 seconds 17.0 links which is about 3.4 meters approximately which I measured up and that's what I found there may be a rock mark over there I might have a quick sticky beak but uh, I think for today's survey that should be enough well there you go I'm the global surveyor just remembering when we're out looking for survey marks that fences can be misleading fences aren't always on the boundary line as you can see here and quite confusing uh, to try and figure out you know you might think that's the corner or you might think that's the corner actually there's a corner and there's a reference mark thanks so much for watching please like subscribe follow the channel leave a comment happy to chat about any surveying questions you may have i'm the global surveyor thanks so much for watching see you later just to conclude uh, why you can't rely on fencing well here's a fence here and if you would think that that post is on the corner then the survey mark in this instance is one one foot and six inches which is 0.457 of a meter from the post if the post is on the corner now doing that would get you out say where my feet are but here's the survey mark here, the reference mark, which is one foot six from the corner. It's a GI pipe with a galvanized iron nail in the top of it, buried about 150 under the ground here. Thing is, 0.457 of a meter from, and I'll get my measuring tape out just to show you. 457. That's about there. That's where the post should be, just there. So you can see the end of the tape is where the post should be and how sometimes surveyors can spend hours and hours looking for marks and not having much luck because you're digging further out than you should be. I was only able to find that point because I found those two rock marks further down the road. Okay, that concludes the video. Thanks so much again for watching and we'll see you next time on The Global Surveyor. Have a great day.